So I went up to a, a good friend's house the other day and I hadn't been there in a while. Rang the doorbell, looked up. There's a camera, a security camera staring at me. He answers the door. I go, when'd you get the fake security camera? He goes, that's not fake. <laughs> yes, it is. He goes, well, how do you know? Because real security cameras don't have red light up lights on them. The only thing worse than a red light on the front of a security camera is a red flashing light on a security camera. Reality is security cameras don't need to try and convince you that they're real security cameras. Now, back uh, 20 years ago, there was a few cameras with a red light on them to let you know they were operating, but not for the last uh, two decades. So if you see a security camera with a red light or red flashing light, go ahead and commit a crime right in front of it because it ain't gonna record anything. <laughs> you know, there's one more aspect to fake security cameras that I probably should mention because it was kind of a big deal, especially in commercial environments. If you were to take a fake security camera and put it at, let's say, let's say a parking structure of a mall, and you did it just to deter crime, you might have some serious liability for the simple reason. If you've got a pretty young girl that comes out, sees the cameras, believes there's a level of security in that parking structure that doesn't really exist, and she goes out and something bad happens to her, you could be completely liable financially and anything else for what happens to her. Fake security cameras, you gotta be real careful with them. You don't want to imply a level of security or safety that doesn't actually exist.